Some libraries want to know which of their titles have been securely digitized and archived by HathiTrust, and which of those might be made available to their users. With this in mind, SCS matches the records in your catalog with those in HathiTrust. Some of the titles in HathiTrust are in the public domain, while many are still in copyright. Even for non-members, HathiTrust allows libraries to add a Hathi URL to the local catalog record of public domain titles. This has become increasingly common and offers users the convenience of clicking directly through to full text. To assist with this process, SCS identifies your library's titles that are in the public domain, and in exported lists, we provide a URL to the appropriate Hathi record. These can be batch-loaded to the local OPAC. For SCS libraries, between 1 and 8 percent of circulating monographs are in the public domain. The average is 4.8, which could represent a significant weeding opportunity for those who want to take advantage of it. Here's how it works. In Greenglass, a tally of items in HathiTrust appears at the bottom of the project page. This tally represents all HathiTrust matches, both public domain and in copyright. It's typically around 50%. On the Green Glass Collection page, you can use the HathiTrust overlay to see how many of your items are in the Hathi corpus. Hathi matches are shown in green. Public domain titles are represented by the bright green tips. In Green Glass item lists, Hathi public domain and in copyright flags appear in the detail pane along with other SCS compiled metadata. In the Green Glass Query Builder, we scroll down the left panel to find and set parameters regarding HathiTrust status. To create a list of your library's public domain items, click here. You can immediately see the percentage of your collection with this status, and you can scroll down the page to see the list of items. Click here to export the list. For a detailed description of the SCS HathiTrust matching logic, please refer to the Greenglass help document, which can be accessed here.